Hello, beautiful human. You just clicked on, really, what is the most intense thing we as a show have ever done. We invited into our studio Good Witch Patty. She is legit. Marilyn Manson uses her when he wants to channel spirits, and that's what she did in our studio. Late one night, we we channeled spirits, and spirits definitely came through. It's emotional. It's intense. It's really a journey. If you can't watch the whole thing, skip through a little bit, but definitely try to get from the top to the end so you can understand it fully. Um, yeah, it, I got to stop talking, just watch it, but I, I'm getting goosebumps. Okay, here's our seance. It's the Zach Sang Show, and uh, in our studio right now is Patty Negri. Got it. She is a good witch <laughs> and a psychic medium. Dan and Heather, are you cool to be open? Oh, I'm open. She's so like open. 7-11. I'm uh, ready. Uh, me as well. Okay. Um, she is preparing the opening yes. or the unveiling to let spirits in. I don't like fire. <laughs> Light and dark are turning. Luck be in the burning. Light and dark are turning. Luck be in the burning. Black spirits and white, red spirits and gray, mingle, mingle, mingle who may. Thout a tout tout around and about, a world within and a world without. A world within and a world without. The good stay in and the ill stay out. <sighs> I want to open and lift the veil. I want to call in the beautiful east winds to blow through and take out anything negative and just bring in possibility and real communication. I want to call the fire of the south, that passion, that creativity, to again get rid of anything that's negative or not welcome, but really burn and bring to life for real spirits, for everyone here to be able to see or feel or sense. I want to call in the west, the waters, ah, the emotions of the body, the waters, the mists of the ancestors. I want to call in the north, Mother Earth herself, to give us strength to give us safety like a strong tree with roots that go deep into the earth and branches that reach through the sky there's a place where we all go where near the frost or cold winds blow and friends remembered reunite and those who hate forget their spite we gather around these gentle beings we call you now to bless our meeting heaven's promise our spirits thrive and now for the living let the dead come alive as we lift the veil between the worlds the veil is open Did anybody feel just right around the side of your head everything getting lighter through here you're very intuitive, by the way. Did you feel a little bit of something come in? Something just kind of whoosh through the room a little bit as we lift it. I of. feel heavy as well. Right? You feel a little heavy. I think I'm kind of like a little further in this chair than yes. I was before. Okay. <laughs> well, everything has changed, and that's yeah. what you want to. That's what you want to feel for. I feel something in my head, like my, my like. In your hand or your head? Here it feels lighter. No, this is what I was saying. This is yeah. your crown of illumination. Something whooshed through right about head level. You are going to feel different. We're not, I mean, we're in our realm, our dimensional, but it's different now. We've lifted that veil. It's it's thinner. You do have a, you, you whether he's here all the time, you do have a, a, a kind of a mischievous male spirit that hangs here. That's what was hanging over here in the corner. Um so uh, little things, like little things could be moved or not where you put them sometimes, if you ever notice stuff like that. That's what spirits like that could do. Changes and stuff, feel something on you. This one, it feels not negative, but kind of mischievous, kind of youth mischievous. Like um, in a fun way. In a fun way, okay. yeah. Um, and I think, yeah, he didn't come with the 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 building or anything. I think he's just attracted to, to you, your energy, what you do, and just, you know, kind of like a fan from the other side. I wonder who it is. 
Um, it's spirits that are fans. That's great. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they, that. it's spirits can be fans. Yeah. Isn't that isn't that wild? I'll take it anywhere. <laughs> take it, take it anywhere you can get it. All the fans will get. Um, what I'm hearing, either his name or he likes it, boots. Does boots mean anything to any of you? The word boots. Ever talked about boots? Boots. My friend had a dog named Boots. Maybe Boots is here. No, this is a male, <laughs> youthful male, and he kind of does. He he's kind of like air guitaring in the corner, <laughs> if that makes sense. Yeah. I like that. He's doing this little. Yeah. I got a lot of music playing out in here. Yeah, here. which awesome. makes sense. That will draws in spirits. Music yeah. is is magic in itself. It opens things. You know, it might it might not mean anything to you it just might be what he wants to say or it might hit you in three days which often is it's kind of like uh, say on some niche you're going oh of course it's whatever let's ask him questions you want to ask him questions i don't want to do all the talking the dowsing rods are out yes (laughs) um have you listened to our show before yes if he's hanging out in the studio he's definitely heard it (laughs) is it bad Oh, cool. Oh, nice. So he's a fan. <laughs> um, <laughs> is Dan cool? <laughs> Nothing. Boots. I agree with you. <laughs> Have we met you before, Boots? No. Ooh, that's we weird. Do we know you personally? Oh. Yes. I don't know. Mm-mm. No? No. Mm-mm. Where in the room are you right now? Nope, nope. <laughs> no, it's it just went back to the corner. Oh, yeah, corner. he's in the corner. He's pacing, yeah. Nobody puts my boots in the corner. <laughs> okay. Um so so a boots. Can you point at Zach? Oh, boots. It, it just pointed at me. Mhm. Hi do boots. Want, do you want to touch Zach? On the hand. You can touch me, Boots. You're allowed. It's the most action he'll ever get. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. Is that a yes? Oh, yeah. That's yes. Okay. Okay. So just relax a little bit. It's going to be really subtle if you feel it. Relax your hand a little <laughs> bit more. Right yeah. He's right there. He's right by you. Do you feel a change of temperature a little bit? Yeah, I just got breeze. cold. Yeah, I, just yeah, got I feel the breeze too. Really I don't know cold. if it was the air conditioning, but it, I don't think so. Dude, my right hand feels tingly. I think I'm crying. Your cry- right hand. I'm cry- I think I'm crying. I think he's touching this hand where the microphone is. Oh, I forgot to tell you, everything is reversed on the other side. Oh. Yeah. Oh, so he's touching his. Then he's touching his left hand. Well, no, he's probably touching his right hand when I said to touch his left hand. Oh, it's it gets backwards. Like if you do a dumb supper for somebody when they've passed, you do it backwards. Do dessert and then dinner, then then super salad course because it's mirror image. You're feeling it. Yeah, he's touching my hand. I know he is. Yeah, he is. He's. (laughs) You're making He's, me cry. Why do I have tears coming down my face? <laughs> That's so <laughs> weird. Because is spirit that? is present. Spirit <laughs> is everywhere. Because because he's a he's a really good fan this boots we're just gonna call him boots yeah, can i ask you another like question yeah yeah and we could try the ouija board or the drawing thing too yeah would okay. love to communicate with boots more okay i want to know where he's from i, I, I want to know why he's making me tear right now mm. he just touched me he likes you it's a good thing dan okay so let's let's try the board okay we want to wake this up Ouija boards get a bad rap, but you just can't let just anybody in. It's like a door. You don't just let anybody into your house. You just say only who you allow in. But so right now, we want the spirit as Boots to be able to talk, so we want to wake it up. So Boots, can you can you move the planchette on the board? Can you move it through their fingers? Can you just move it any direction right now to start? Yeah. I see you guys aren't touching this. I'm not moving no. it. Zach. No. Yeah. I'm following it. Yeah, you're following it. That's how it's supposed to work. Okay, so we know that's you, Boots. So they have questions for you. Um, Is your name Boots, or is that your nickname, Boots? (laughs) Wait, what? (laughs) This is moving. I'm not even looking at the letters. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, he'll be. Yeah, that's good. He's liking this. Oh, jeez. Where are we going? I don't know. What's that? Is there a letter? Can you read it? Letter? N. N. Oh my god. O. No, no. 
Oh, so no. No, his no, name is in boots or nickname. Boots. So, so do you, do you have a? Are you moving this or is I'm it just? Moving. No, it, this is what a Ouija board does. <laughs> It's a spirit board. So, Boots, we, we, what would you prefer us to call you? Do you want us to call you Boots? What is happening here? <laughs> oh, my God. Here we go. <laughs> so weird. What is that letter? I can't see it. That's an H. 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 Same name. That'd be awesome. Q? HQ. HQ? Like headquarters? <laughs> Damn, are you sure you're not moving this? I'm, I'm just, I'm just touching barely. Yeah. HQI. HQI. Heather, are you moving this? No, I'm not moving this. This is freaking me <laughs> out, man. HQI P. This is really hard. We, again, we're gonna call you Boots too. We have something that's pronounceable. H-Q-I-P. Some vowels, perhaps. HQIP. Are these your initials? Maybe in the other realm. H Q I P U. Hiccup, kick you. Hiccup. Maybe he's not the best speller. It's often people aren't the best spellers on Ouija boards for whatever reason. If that schooling goes out, maybe he wants to draw. I don't know. Yeah. Want to try the, the drawing? Board? Yeah, let's try the chalkboard. So same thing. Put the little fingers on the little end. Okay, boots, or whatever your name is. Can you just move that? Show them how to move that. Can you make a shape or something? Yeah. There you go. Yeah. He's here. He's just kind of cracking up. He's, he honestly feels about 15. Young. Oh, he's young. Yeah. That's our core demo. <laughs> he's trying to tell us how he died. Maybe he like fell in a well. Maybe he died in a t- tornado. Or... Oh, I don't want to speculate on his death. Well, no, we're not. Well, we could ask him yes and no things. Boots like circles. I feel like the circle has a meaning. Tornado? No, there's two O's in boots. Oh, yeah, there is two O's in boots. And he is kind of making it like two. Boots, what are you trying to tell us? I think he's really enjoying being able to move something in the physical realm. Um Oh, we're moving a little bit. Oh, oh yeah, there we go. Do oh. something different, Boots. Make it make something. Yeah, communicate with us, man. Look. Wait, oh, he's not done. Is he done? Uh, he's making a happy face or uh, something. Oh, he, oh, he made like a that. face. Oh, okay, so he wants to go. thought it was done. Boots. What's up, bro? Oh. I think those are glasses. I wear glasses. Uh, no, now it was, but now it's... <laughs> Has anybody got word that he moved, just drawn a face and a big X through it? Oh, maybe that's it. All right, let's let's look and see. He really looked like, this was, until this crossover, it was a face. It was like a really much face with big eyes or glasses, and it had a perfect little smile right here. So what is he? Maybe he doesn't like me. <laughs> I have glasses. Maybe it's because you're the one that didn't believe he was real. That's and now he's calling you out saying, look. Total, totally possible. I see you. Boots. Are you trying to send a message to Heather? Dowsing rods are out. Do you like Heather? Yes. Oh, great. Were you drawing Heather? No. Were you drawing a face? Sort so of. He was, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Is it the face of somebody in this room? No. Oh. Wait. You wear glasses sometimes. And I don't have them on now. I was when I when I walked behind my desk I was looking for my glasses and I couldn't find them I'm going to cry and I want my mom (laughs) maybe maybe he likes it when you have your glasses on he prefers them are you saying I would be able to see you if I had my glasses on he just said yes wow are you are you here for Dan (gasps) oh Dan's crying that's so cute Uh, wait okay Uh, Dan do you have a friend that like died when they were young 
by any chance? I've not when I was young. Like but 15, when like they were young. Yeah, I have tears going down my face. You see this? No, I can, I'm right next to you, yes. <laughs> they do, won't stop. <laughs> do, <laughs> I'm do you know, this is here for you. Can I ask some questions? Yeah. Do you know somebody who died as a, a, a teen? Whether you were close to them or not? Maybe from your school or something growing up? I think so. Do you know Dan personally, Boots? How do we know he's 15? Because he, he looks and acts 15, what I'm saying. Oh. He's kind of lanky, kind of... 15 and energy I'm getting from him his he doesn't have good verbal skills are you at, are are you are, are you 15 or are you I can't ask real questions well like, it was just, just are, you a teen, kill, are you a teenager boot yeah, okay. yeah yeah do you listen to Dan on the radio Ooh. oh maybe you're maybe he likes you the best you're his Aww. favorite is Dan your favorite oh, oh. tiny s Aww. All right, looks like we're getting along. This is good. <laughs> <laughs> he's probably making you cry so that you know that he's real. Yeah. You know what I mean? You want him to touch you? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> um, Can you touch my head? Yeah. Should I take my hat off? Uh, either way. <laughs> what are you going to do, Dan? Do you feel something behind you right now? I mean, my back's a little... <laughs> As well, it's a little uh, tingly. Yeah. Touching you, bro. Yeah. Kind of feels like Heather's like more behind me, but I assume she's right there. I'm right left. here. That's good yeah. to know. No, he is right behind you. It feels like there's more pressure on my back. It's like a tingly yeah. pressure pushing me forward. Yeah. Just make sure he doesn't go too low, you know? <laughs> <laughs> no, he likes you. He's a, he's a kid. He's a, he's a fan. I think he's a fan of the whole show, all of you. Yeah. But something about you. He, oh, okay. He's 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 willing to talk a little bit. Um, I don't think he'll talk through me because I just don't think we, he. You remind him of his big brother. He had a big brother. Okay. He um. Who I, th I think he was. It looks kind of Midwesty wherever he's from, and I actually think he 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 was like a skateboard accident. That's sad. Dan skateboards. Do yeah. do you? Okay, I don't know that. Yeah. Okay, it was like a skateboard thing. So again, you he just yeah he just tried something, and I don't think he died immediately, but it, there was you know damage to the brain or something like that, bleeding in the brain. Do you feel it? Yeah, he's there. So you're here, you're his adopted big brother. You're, My head's all tingly. Yeah, that's because you said touch his head. He's a. And, <laughs> it's real weird. <laughs> <laughs> Ghosts are good. See. Dan is a fan. How long has he been in the studio? That's hard for him. Time and space doesn't exist on the other side. He uh, something since something was red. This. What does that mean? Do you remember something? Our colors our, used to be red. <laughs> our logo used, we, to be yeah, red. logo used to be oh, red. Oh, okay. So he's probably been with us since maybe. Did they travel? 20. Like, if we were in New York, would they travel with us? Oh yeah. So maybe he's the maybe time he's, and space means nothing yeah, to them. So maybe they, maybe he's, maybe Boots has been with us since we were in New York, and we have no, we just didn't know at that time. I think he is a fan, and he was a fan either in life or death. And when he passed, he just took to you all, and really to you. Um. If you start, <laughs> if you start feeling something on your ear, that's him. Like a little tickle on your ear. Do you ever feel some? Sometimes, do you ever feel? Uh, maybe I, not that I can. I'm, okay, am well, I, no, no, no. Maybe you will it's, feel that. Yeah. You probably just thought it was like the the AC yeah. kicking in or something. Now you'll be aware. To be aware, because that's here. that's because he's he's kind of going like this. It's cool, huh? He's not scary. No, he's not scary. I just want to know how I know him. I think I, I like think I, he I, just I, knows you from the radio. Yeah. <laughs> I think That's he it. knows you. He's like literally a fan. Can we ask him if um, yeah. he was a fan when he was alive? Okay. Did Boots? Did you know? The, did you know our show when you were alive? Yes. Can we? Did, can we ask him if he died like recently? Did you die like recently, Boots? Within the last ten years. Oh. Yeah. 
And we've been we've been we've been on for a it's while. Off. So, what are you thinking right now? And you're freaking me out. You might be relating some things. Mm -hmm. And again, emotions go high when the veil is thin. Everybody's raw. Everybody. You're putting some dots together. Yeah. This kind of stuff is, happens all the time. And it's going to happen more and more as the veil thins. Besides that it's near Halloween that it thins. We're moving into a different age. Like literally the age of Aquarius they sang about in the 60s. There's less solid ground. It's not black and white, right and wrong. It's getting very liquid. So more and more the supernatural world, the paranormal world is going to cross over more and more. That's why people are, there's more seekers and trying to figure things out. And we're going to thank them and just have them step back into the darkness. We're closing the veil. We step back into the darkness. And like a big net, we slowly close the veil between the worlds. We're open. Okay. Close this board. Close the Ouija. Close the chalkboard. Close it down. Close the door. Back to the mundane world. I appreciate you deeply. <laughs> Patty the Good Witch, you are really incredible. Thank you. I don't Thank know if you. I feel the same. You, I, he doesn't like me. Really? I didn't bring him here. It's not her fault. Yeah, what, what did she do? I'm just kidding. We got along great. <laughs> yeah. I really appreciate you yeah. doing this and sharing this with us and giving us this experience out to bottom. I mean, yeah, I learned a lot and you made a lot of, uh, I don't know. Do you believe? He you always, always believed. Always did. I never didn't. Weird. I just wasn't expecting this today, so. Yeah. Well, they, they, we, don't, they don't follow script. Yeah, right. <laughs> so you never know what you get. We appreciate you. Thank you for bringing so, them through. Thank, thank you, you, everybody. Thank you for having me on the show. Do you have Instagram, Twitter? I like? do. I have all of the above. Um, Patty Negri, P-A-T-T-I-N-E-G-R-I, pattynegri.com, Instagram, Patty Negri, Twitter, Patty Negri, Facebook, Patty Negri. <laughs> Come you, like me, follow me. I have a really fun monthly newsletter with all sorts of magical things you guys can do yourself. Cool. Yeah. She's the real deal. The real, <laughs> she, she, you, we can all agree. Oh, yeah. Dude, sister's at, confirm. She was at Marilyn Manson's house. You think he's going to have anybody who's bootleg <laughs> no, at his house doing absolutely. this? Yeah, but I'm a good wit. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> good wit. You really are. Like thank, Linda. Thank yeah. you so much for being here. Thank you very much. Thank, thank you. you. Love. Patty Negri, the good witch. Appreciate yeah. you. Yeah.